Today we're looking back into the history of a faction born from a desire for unhinged greatness, worldwide recognition, and ultimately, personal power. I'm Kevin Kelly, and this is The Recount, a show that dives into some of the most exciting and significant moments in New Japan Pro Wrestling's fascinating history. Formed in 2013, Bullet Club has collected the top alpha personalities in the world and given them an outlet to express their volatile nature. The most popular faction in professional wrestling has racked up a long history of shocking backstabs that, given the details of its formation, shouldn't come as a surprise to anybody. It all started when Prince Devitt turned against his Apollo Go-Go tag team partner, Ryusuke Taguchi. No more, Apollo Go -Go. no more Mr. Nice Guy. Mm. Say hello to my bouncer, the underboss, Bad Luck Ballet. And you're looking at the real rock and roller, Prince Devitt. Devitt was later joined by Tama Tonga and Carl Anderson. Oh. Devitt labeled the rebellious group Bullet Club. Even as a three-time IWGP junior heavyweight champion, Prince Devitt learned the hard way that being a founding member wasn't enough to protect him from the faction's natural hostility. Hey, what are you looking at, you little pervert? While settling bad blood against Ryusuke Taguchi, his former Apollo Go-Go tag team partner, Devitt ordered the newest Bullet Club members, Matt and Nick Jackson, not to interfere in this personal match. The stakes were too high. Loser leaves New Japan. But that request would go against the faction's cardinal rule of doing whatever they want. And that's exactly what the Young Bucks did to poor Taguchi. When the real rock and roller got in their faces for it, we saw one of the earliest examples of Bullet Club friendly fire. On the one-year anniversary of Bullet Club's creation, its integral founding member was ousted from New Japan Pro Wrestling. <laughs> Bullet Club wasn't down a member for long, as a surprise attack on IWGP heavyweight champion Kazuchika Okada later that same night came at the hands of their newest member, AJ Styles. <laughs> I want this title, and I will have this title, because now I have the ammunition. Receiving help from Yujiro Takahashi double-crossing his chaos partner, Styles became the first to bring the IWGP Heavyweight Championship to the faction. <laughs> Bullet Club went on to dominate not only New Japan, but the entire wrestling world. Yet they lacked the real threat in the junior division. There was still a void left by Prince Devitt that needed to be filled. That is until... I present to you the cleaner, Kenny Omega! Nanto! Kenny Omega! But Taguchi, I want that championship belt buster. I am here to clean up the junior division. But a force like Kenny Omega was never going to be satisfied for very long. And the result, a violent mutiny against Styles. Whoa, 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 wait a second, wait a second, what the oh, hell is this? He just stepped AJ Styles off the top. One way thanks a lot, AJ. Led by a fed up and overshadowed Kenny Omega. You better not be surprised. You had this coming, AJ. We gave you the big matches. 
We gave you the big pay-per-views. We made you a star. We paid you like a star. While I struggled, while I starved, forcing myself to be a junior. Omega and the Young Bucks felt that they owned the top skills within the faction and branded themselves as the elite. The elite, we rule the world. Under the cleaner, Bullet Club polished its prestige and bulked up its tag team roster. Omega won the IWGP Intercontinental Championship, last held by Shinsuke Nakamura, and became the first ever non-Japanese G1 Climax winner. But after a majority of their belts were stripped away and Kenny failed to claim the IWGP Heavyweight title, Bullet Club sought a new addition. Is the world ready for the American Nightmare? The American Nightmare Cody rekindled the faction's success, but there was still the tall task of taking the IWGP Heavyweight belt from Okada, and this strained the relationship between Omega and Cody. Why is Cody wanting to throw the towel in? The faction's infighting was amplified when Cody targeted Omega's former tag team partner, Kota Ibushi. And now Cody is going after Ibushi. Yeah, he wants revenge for last night. It's Omega! It's Kenny Omega! Omega. He's the leader, I think that's yeah. obvious. Omega did not mince Cody words. Cody doesn't like he it. He told him right there. The and Bullet he... Club hasn't been whole for a long time. We need unity. I know exactly what we need. Switchblade. Wow. wow. Switchblade. So there's your news being made out of New Year's Dash. Wait a minute! What the hell? And Omega's shocking loss to Switchblade Jay White for the IWGP US Championship shook the grounds of both Bullet Club and the Elite. What the hell just happened? We've got a new US Champion! And it's Switchblade Jay White! And now it looks like Hangman's decision was rendered. Hangman Page was down here to perhaps challenge the new champ. And I can't believe what we just oh, saw. Doing? What's this about? Oh. You can't take his moment. Hey. You lost, it's good. Like, like a leader. Right. 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 You don't right. need to right. stand here, right. you're back. Right. Whoa, Whoa. Oh, no. Kenny just pushed back. His best friend. Wait a minute, Adam. It's good. Water on the bridge. It's good. Water on the bridge. Thank you. What the hell? What? You son Jesus of a bitch! Prick! Crossroads! What is wrong with Cody? This is the implosion of Bullet Club that we predicted, that we've waited to see. Cody, wait a minute! What is this? Abushi! 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 What began as a fight between two demanding personalities turned into an all-out civil war. Front end was showing yo oh. and the young buck. He says he can't do it. Oh, give it, 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 give it. Lovers. Oh. Like hitting a dead body. That's it. The golden trigger. comes Kenny Omega, and there goes Cody. And he extending his hand to the injured Matt Jackson. Matt's not sold on it, though. Yeah, he's... And sometimes in war, there are casualties. And I wish I could be happy about the situation between the elite. The silver lining is that the Golden Lovers are back. Dominion. June 9, 2018, Osaka Joe Hall. Kenny Omega struck down Goliath, the Rainmaker, Kazuchika Okada, and earned the title as IWGP Heavyweight Champion for the first time in his career. What's the man? What's the man? What's the man? Kenny Omega has done it! Judas, how 
satisfying is this? More important to Omega at this moment than the belt is the hug with the Bucks. Well, he could have done the honorable thing. He could have done the right thing. Yeah, go the back. Belt, shaking the belt. Never does those things. We are seeing here, hoisting high on the shoulders, and deservedly so. Kenny Omega is the new IWGP Heavyweight Champion. You can live your dreams and your nightmares at the exact same time. Omega and Cody left it up to an IWGP heavyweight title defense to determine who was going to be leading the faction. I want to see the look when he sees you in pain and when the rest of the world sees me as the leader. No questions asked. That was a notion that set off the Bullet Club veterans, the OGs. Fed up with the talk about who would be their leader, Tama Tonga led the charge against the elite. Firing squad. He just, he just uh, shed his Bullet Club shirt. The Young Bucks can't get there to help in any way. Hangman Page. Vowing to take the faction back to its roots. Uh, Tony had a hell of a match, Josh, but he got beat fair and square. He did, these guys. Is this a joyous reunion or another setup? Handing him a chair. Omega's at your mercy. The firing squad looks to give the boot to those who they feel no longer represent true Bullet Club. There is no leader. We are all equal. You, Kenny. You, Cody. All that bitter and bullshit. Over. And now Cody extending his hand to Kenny Omega. Not something I thought I would see anytime soon, to be honest. The future of Bullet Club is anybody's guess. The Bullet Club yeah. has arrived! Bullet Club is united around Omega! Oh, deep trigger! We are Bullet Club, and we do what we want. Subscribe to New Japan Pro Wrestling on YouTube so you never miss an episode of The Recount. And visit NJPWWorld.com to see all of these exciting matches in full.